Hey knitters, it's Thursday. Um, I almost forgot to make this video. I was about to walk out of the house to go to karaoke because that is what I do on my Thursday nights. Um, and then I was like, I didn't make a video last week and then I'm making a video this week and I'm the worst person ever. But I'm like pretty sure no one else made a video this week either. So I feel less guilty. Um, the theme from last week was high five yourself, but I currently am holding the camera with one of my hands. So I'm just gonna high five you guys. High five. Um, I would high five myself because I've been awesome today. Um, and today in general has been pretty awesome, mostly because the weather has been gorgeous. Like I haven't seen weather this pretty in months and months and months and months. And it just, it was so nice. I went running for like two miles in like a little preserve thing near my house and there was like a dock and there was like water in the ocean and it was so pretty and I was like spring um so that's my weather comments for today uh yeah Jenny I did later mention something about Vancouver to somebody and about having visited it and they were like you haven't visited Vancouver and I was like where's Vancouver <laughs> so I'm dumb I'm sorry I have been to Ottawa Toronto Ontario. Those those are my Canadian places I know. And apparently I confuse one of them for Vancouver. So, no, don't go to Vancouver because it'll be even farther from me. <laughs> um, but Canadian Canadian school might be cool. That rhymed. Whatever. Um, but yeah, yeah. Grad school choices are scary and I really, I really wish you luck and, but I'm sure whichever one you pick, you will love it because whatever, library science is like a cool thing to go into and every once in a while I'm just like so happy, so happy I'm in it. So wherever you pick, you're gonna love it. So that's the thing. Um, Kayla was talking about Game of Thrones, which I love. I've been meaning to read the books. I started reading the first one. I've seen the show. Um, and I started reading the first one, and I got about halfway through, and then I just stopped. But, new thing that I've been doing is listening to audiobooks in the car, because I have about a 40-minute drive to school every day. Um, and I often get there early, because sometimes with traffic, it's more than 40 minutes. So I always leave plenty of extra time, and then I get to school, like, half an hour early. So I have all this, like, time where I'm not able to do anything else so I was like I should listen to audiobooks considering I don't listen to book read books ever anymore um so actually the first book I listened to was Divergent mainly because I've heard so much buzz about it and I hadn't really considered it and I was just like let me listen to it and I don't know if it's because I listened to it and the voice actor was amazing or if the book was actually that good but like I really enjoyed it um and I really miss reading, like, young adult type books, I guess. Which is sad because I want to be a young adult librarian. Whatever. But I just haven't had time to read any um, of the new YA books. So it was it was nice to read something that's, like, popular now. Um, and I'm going to probably listen to the other ones in the series because I want to find out what happens. Um, so that's my book recommendation for today, I guess, or something. Uh... Kayla also talked about adulting, I think. I think you were talking about being an adult well, or like getting your own apartment, um, which is a scary prospect, but like really exciting, I guess. Like my friend is um, currently in the process of moving to Albany, which is like four hours away from here. Um, and she's just like, and she oh, she's like, I don't understand this girl. This girl's 20 and has her entire life together. She like has the perfect job lined up at Albany, getting her own apartment. I don't even understand. Anyway, <laughs> the point is that she keeps saying that everyone keeps asking if she's nervous and she keeps just saying, no, like I've been waiting for this forever. I just want my own place. So that's a thing that is maybe related. Mm -hmm. This video is really random. I apologize. It's also like almost five minutes long. What? Um, I have no crocheting or knitting news whatsoever because I have done nothing but schoolwork the past week. But luckily, I've really enjoyed the things that I was writing about, even if I was whining about them as I was doing them. Um, one of the papers I had was a paper about appeal in children's books. Um, like what appeals to children about books and stuff like that. And it was really cute to write. Um, and I gotta use some really cool software that recommends books and all sorts of stuff. 
um everything my my everything's shining in my glasses here we go i'll just talk like a librarian um i don't know um and wait there's something else oh in my other paper i had to write an annotated bibliography which i hate i hate those things um but i had to do it on 12 articles An annotated bibliography is when you you probably know but it, when you take the citations of different articles and then write a like 150 word to 200 word um blurb i guess about it and stuff um that was a bad description but anyway so i had to do that um and i did it on 12 articles and originally i was going to do my paper about advanced technology in libraries like lending out things like laptops or ipads or 3d printing and all that sort of stuff and i sort of ended up focusing on 3d printers in libraries and um maker spaces if you don't know what maker space um, a maker space is you should look it up because i cannot describe it in this video because i will just talk for like 20 minutes um but yeah so maker spaces and 3d printers in libraries which is apparently like a booming thing and i found so many articles about it and i was so excited about that because anything that has to do with like 3d printing or makers as they call themselves is all like about people being really really excited to create and they're all like really into it so all the articles were really fun to read um so yeah i've had a lot of work this week but i've enjoyed doing it i guess um and now I've been talking for like a really long time and I have to go, you know, karaoke it up. So I will see Michael tomorrow. Hopefully. Okay. Bye.